Hello my friends, we're here today to see how you can import your listings from a channel and then link existing listings on another channel without duplicating them. We start here from my Nembo interface in the products tab. You can see I've got a couple of uh, products which are uh, published on uh, Facebook pages and that's it, there's nothing else, right? Two items. So I go in channels and as an example, I got my two eBay 1 and eBay 2 channels already logged. I got number 1 and number US and uh, I uh, check the uh, import settings from uh, number 1, import from eBay, I'm importing active uh, listing status, only the buy now and uh, from all, uh, all eBays, that's fine, so I don't need to save and I simply click import. Uh, I read the warning if I want and give it an OK. So now I will be back in the products tab in a second. The system auto refreshes and it will start importing uh, my eBay products in, uh, in a bit. I may want to refresh. Here we are. It has uh, begun to import listings from eBay. You can see we now have uh, 167 items. There's no linking between eBay and Facebook pages, of course. The linking exists only between uh, e-commerce channels. And uh, the listings to link need to share the exact same SKU codes and set of SKU codes. Uh, you can see we're still, uh, still importing. There's 222 items. I was saying listings to be linked need to share exactly the same SKU code if they're single products or exactly the same set of SKU code if we're talking about uh, products with uh, variations. So let's imagine a product has uh, uh, two colors and uh, three sizes. This means uh, two by three, six variations. And in order to link, all six variations must be identical in uh, the first channel, in this case eBay, and the second channel, and all six must uh, have uh, SKU codes. Okay, now, uh, it seems that the import from eBay is complete. I'm trying to refresh, yeah, 222, so I can go on channels, and uh, as an instance, I can import from, uh, from Shopify, and I could import, I could import and link uh, from Shopify, Etsy, and uh, WooCommerce and Amazon. And the linking works by importing again. And what happens is that uh, if uh, at the moment of import, Nemble finds a product which shares exactly the same SKU codes, it will connect the product, the listing in the original channel, in our case eBay, and on uh, channel number two and three, four, five subsequent without importing them, again, so without duplications, and without the need to cancel the listing from either of the two or three or four channels and uh, relisting it. So now uh, from Shopify, I'm checking the import from Shopify uh, settings in Nemble, and uh, uh, you can see I'm importing all statuses, and uh, I'm importing all, all collections. So again, no need to save. And uh, let me click import. You can read here import from Shopify started. It's working. And uh, the system refreshes into the products uh, tab. And uh, we may see already some products imported from Shopify or not. Yes, we do have some. Okay, so now we imported a bunch of products from eBay and a, a bunch of products from Shopify. And you can see uh, here in the, the channels tab, there's only the Shopify. At some point we'll probably meet either refreshing it. Let me put more, uh, more products per page. We will meet some products with two icons. The Shopify icon, because there's, it has been imported, and, not alone, also the eBay icon, if it linked. Here we are. So one, two, three, four products. You can see there's two icons and uh, these guys here linked. So what do we mean by linking? The first channel, eBay in, in our case, is the leading channel. 
which means that 5 is the quantity on eBay. If by any chance the quantity in the Shopify listing was different from 5, now they're linked and uh, at the first edit, Nemble will equate the quantity in the second channel to the quantity of the leading channel. Now, you can see a bunch of products linked and a bunch of other, other products didn't link. We have the two, we can see here, the two messages, Nemble is done importing your products from eBay, 220 products, and then we're gonna have another message, there it is, cool, Nemble is done importing your products from Shopify, 887 products imported, of which 77 linked to products already existing in your Nemble account and 206 were stopped by an error and the difference was imported. You can download the error file and check the error. What are the possible errors? Possible errors are the same SKU but not all variants or same variants but different SKUs. These are the two types uh, of errors that are matched by that uh, error file. To fix this you go in your source channel, in this case into either Shopify or eBay, fix, edit the SKU code, delete the product by selecting it, one or two or how, how many you want, in Nemble and going into Actions, Delete. You can delete it, you can delete them and import them again after you fix them. This is the current, current status. Now, an important note for free trial users. During the free trial, you can import only up to 10 products per channel. So if you have, uh, say, 1,000 products in your uh, channel number one, in, in our case eBay, or your case maybe Etsy, and you got another 1,000 products in the second channel, you only import 10 of each. Chances that uh, the first 10 match the, the second 10 out of 1,000 is, is very low. So how, would you, how could you proceed? And the suggestion is uh, if, if you have a chance to create a specific collection, this is possible in, uh, in Shopify. Here, for instance, I created the collection uh, Spring-Summer 2021, which connects only products which have a tag equal to SS2021. This way, if I select in Nemble that I want to import only this collection, Nemble will import only three, six, seven products which are my test products. To do this, you go in Channels, Settings, Import from Shopify, Collection. Instead of going All, you go Please Import Only Spring Summer 2021. Save Changes and you're done, right? So if you do this after your first test import and you imported 10 uh, wrong products, you just uh, uh, select Shopify, and delete and then you import again so now I deleted all products imported from Shopify and uh, as I showed I created in uh, Shopify a collection which contains only l up to 10 products which uh, I'm sure have uh, a SKU code which is identical to the, here it is, to the SKU code I have in my eBay listings. And I set the import from Shopify settings as to import only that specific collection, which is the Spring Summer 2021 in our, in our example. Now I click import again. And uh, why are we doing this? We're, we're showing Nemble trial users how they can test the system during the trial. Now we're going to import only seven products from Shopify and uh, all seven of them, three, six and seven, here we are, all seven of them will link. That's it, right? If we check the quantities here, we will probably have that effect I was mentioning earlier in which uh, the quantity of some of these seven is, uh, is actually different in, uh, in Shopify compared to eBay. All right, that's it. That's the whole uh, set of functionalities of the listing feature showed. Just to repeat, this feature enables a seller who has the same listings, the same product listings on uh, two or more channels to import these listings into Nemble from the 
leading channel and uh, to link through Namble the uh, listings already existing on uh, further channels without the need to recreate them, delist them, release them and any other sort of complication. The seller just leaves the listings where they are and uh, can link them with no effort and once they're linked they will be linked for uh, inventory sync, order sync and uh, product updates synchronization. That's all. If you need anything please chat with us in the in-app chat bottom, bottom right and uh, don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel to be informed about the forthcoming videos. Have a great rest of the day.